The story of Yogi Ferrell is far from done on the basketball court. After going undrafted in 2016, today the former Hoosier signing a two-year $5.3 million contract with the Dallas Mavericks. Good timing because he was also in Bluffton today hosting his basketball camp and sports reporter Andy McDonald explains why this trip was special for Yogi. Thanks, Glenn. You may be asking, why is Yogi Ferrell in, of all places, Bluffton, Indiana? Well, here's the short story behind it. The former Hoosier and current Dallas Mavericks guard, he had an idea for a children's book, and he met up with an author from here in Bluffton, Indiana. The basketball camp, that's just a bonus, as he loves to give back to kids. I run up and down the court probably ten times. Yeah, that gives me great confidence. I feel like Dallas looks good on me, and, you know, Mark... Coach, Coach Carlisle, Donnie, those guys all believe in me. And I felt like the city itself has embraced me, and I've embraced the city. And I wouldn't want to be anywhere else other than Dallas. So that's the reason why I chose to go back there. Uh, we're going to have probably one of the most talented backcourts, I feel like. And it's probably going to be tough to say talented in the West because uh, the West is stacked now. I mean, it's top to bottom, the most talented probably players we've seen. Uh, yeah, we got uh, a little children's book coming out. I uh, don't want to give too many details of it just yet, but we've done a great, she's done a great job. I've seen the script, we've got great illustrators, and it's going to be a great project. Don't want to spoil it, but obviously you signed the contract, agreed with the contract. Is there a happy ending in the book, just like kind of for you? <laughs> uh, was that too much? Uh, <laughs> we, we can say there will be a happy ending, just okay. like that. Yeah. From a 10 day contract to now a two year contract with the Dallas Mavericks for Yogi Ferrell, his story is also a happy ending. From Bluffton, Indiana, I'm Andy McDonald, News Channel 15.